The government of Alberta, Canada is handing over the responsibility to regulate the tar sands oil industry to the oil industry. Yeah, that sounds like it's going to work just peachy. The new body that's going to oversee the oil industry is called the AER, or the Alberta Energy Regulator. And don't be fooled by the name because it's a, a private corporation that's funded totally by the fossil fuel industry. It's not some government agency, even though the name is misleading to make you think it's a government agency. Jerry Priotti is the chairman of the board, and he is also one of the founders of the Canadian Association of Petroleum Producers, a major oil lobbying group. I mean, this is, it's like a joke, right? And this isn't even America. We're talking about Canada here, and they're better on a lot of these issues than we are, but not in this one. They're going to have the oil industry regulate themselves. And they're putting on this facade like it's not the oil industry regulating itself because they put some Orwellian name to the group that's funded by the oil industry. So this change couldn't have come at a worse time either because one study found levels of pollution uh, downwind of the oil and tar sands rich industrial heartland. Uh, to rival the lever levels found in the world's most polluted cities. So wherever they're doing this kind of work, downwind from it, totally polluted. And uh, the pollution is also tied to, according to one study, increased incidence of blood cancers in men that live in that area. <laughs> yeah, what a great time to have the oil industry regulate themselves when we find out that they might be causing cancer in people. Yeah, it would appear that you need an independent third party, say the government, to be a watchdog of these groups and to make sure they coincide with safety regulations. This year, uh, an environmental report card even found that an, on average, according to the ERCB, who used to regulate that industry, that Alberta has had two oil spills per day every day for the past 37 years. So you want to talk about a messy industry, uh, an industry that is known for its pollution. Talk about the tar sands oil industry in Alberta, Canada. And this is the worst step they could have possibly done, which is make it so that there's no more oversight. Do whatever you want. And, of course, they're only going to be focused on profit, so they might do some shoddy pipe work. And then there'll be even more oil spills. And the, the environment will get uh, even dirtier and more people will get cancer and more pollution will go in the air. And we'll all sit there uh, and not change anything because money has so corrupted not only politics in America, but apparently politics in Canada that we'd rather die than fix the substantive underlying issue, which is corruption.